After more than four decades of public service, one local sheriff is retiring this month. KPVI News That Works For You journalist Kate Garner sat down with Sheriff Lauren Nielsen, who reflects on how law enforcement has changed over the years. Everybody says they want to make a difference. I think we are making a difference. Bannock County Sheriff Lauren Nielsen is retiring after more than 40 years in public service. I started in 78. Since then, the sheriff has learned some lessons about what it means to be in law enforcement. But when it comes to protecting and serving, it's more to serve. In the last few decades, the sheriff says law enforcement has gotten better at serving those in its care, especially juveniles. When I started here, we had our juvenile cell here, our women's cell here, our misdemeanors here, and our felonies, and they were all bars. Women, men, and juveniles are all separated now for their safety. And that's not the only change that's taken place in the jail over the years. And we brought in uh, simple things like how to write a check, simple things about how to control your temper, simple things about how to be able to uh, save your marriage. The sheriff says the jail and law enforcement in general still has room to improve. And over the years, he's come to realize wearing a badge doesn't necessarily make you a hero, but being married to someone who wears a badge just might. That's the biggest hero that I've got is a woman that'll put up with a cop. And to those who may be thinking about becoming a cop, the sheriff says it's hard, but wants them to know. You may not be able to cure all of this, but you can make a difference. In Pocatello, I'm Kate Garner, KPVI News That Works For You. And Sheriff Nielsen says even though he is retiring, he will continue to fight to get the jail the resources it needs.